No one interviews Maggie in here without a haircut. Sorry, no, just got one. Excuse me, sir. I have a fact for you. It's an actual fact. Yes, Miss Pressman. You know, this is actually her fourth wedding, not her seventh, like they said. I know. But tell me something. Do you think, think she's going to make it all the way this time? I don't know. <gasps> she swallowed her gum. <laughs> she does that. <clears throat> Mr. Shillian, he runs the newsstand. He's also our local bookie, you know? Ah, yes, yes. He's given eight to one odds that she won't. OK. Instead of a, of a haircut, how about a wash? Get all that. City grit out of your hair. You will answer my questions. <laughs> Fine. You wash. I'll ask. So, very good idea. Mm. What do you want to know? Uh, when's the big day? A week from Sunday. Let's just put this um, up here like this because okay. this aromatherapy right. can get a little strong. The lavender. We don't want to put you to sleep. Mm. You nervous? No, I've never been more certain of anything in my life, except. I'm having all kinds of weird dreams. Uh -huh. Would you like to tell me about them? Uh, yeah, sure. And another one. Hey, Pete, I'll be right with you. Okay. I, I, I go inside the church, and everyone I know is there. And the creepiest part is I look down at my dress, mm -hmm. and it's red. I don't know what that means. Red is not my color. What do you think? I think you'd look good in red. No, no. About your hair. <laughs> My jacket, please. Excuse me, sir. Do you know where I could get some shampoo? Some strong shampoo. Doc's Pharmacy, Third and L. Uh, tell him Pete sent you. Uh, you want my hat? No, no, I'm fine. You might need it. <laughs> 